Hello YouTube, in this video I am going to do a review on the official Sanjin Mode 13 nightly build for the OnePlus One. If you go to settings menu about phone you can find I am running Sanjin Mode 13. This is the build number and it's a nightly which is based on Android 6.0 Marshmallow. And you can find other information about the build here and it's also Cyanogen mode updates you can see here, from here and this is the first nightly so you can expect uh, a lot of uh, bugs here but as far as I'm concerned it's pretty usable no issues with uh, anything and uh, all the phone functions are working fine if you go to the settings menu you can find uh, regular notification bar and here you can see edit tiles which is something new I found so you can rearrange the tabs it's more like a, a function we saw in oxygen noise nothing great but it's a new addition that's it and if you go to the battery option you can find uh, battery saver for the changing uh, settings in for the battery threshold and then here is the battery optimization which is called dose so you can customize the battery consumption of each and every application independently and here you also enable app per app profiles and then other than that if you go to the settings menu on top you can find all the regular settings and then buttons you can customize the buttons you can uh, place navigation bar or you can use hardware keys I always prefer hardware keys and then you can customize all the hardware keys from here nothing there on the display everything is same and then here you can find all the off-screen gestures here's a themes option so it support all the themes size and model 12 themes you can suppose and apps storage battery memory so it will show all the memory usage tap pay system profiles and status bar you can customize the status bar from here like you can add clock style battery percentage style if you want a circle and the battery inside you can see like that and customize if you want to show whether you can do that this is just like same as in say a Sanogen mod 12 as well so location security privacy privacy guard local caller list and then filter notification everything is from CM12 Other than that, nothing special. And if you go to the launcher menu, you can find uh, it's a vertical launcher. And audio effects is there, browser is there. And for the camera, they are using Google Camera. Uh, I don't, I don't prefer Google Camera because uh, I like Snapdragon camera with more features. But still, this is an official build, so you can expect this only and file manager google movie music themes and okay so let's talk about the google on tab if you press and hold this home button it will turn on the google on tab feature i'll show an example if you go and play a music from the music player and then if you're tapping home button it brings all the information about that track including the artist name as well as the album name so it's pretty good so the google on tap a function will help you to find information about the about something which is on the current screen besides that there is nothing much to talk about as i told you this is the first nightly build so there is not much features 
to talk about and you can expect bugs as well so let's wait for coming build for flashing uh, that's what i'm thinking and if you want to know how to install this rom there is a link in the description it will show you that just go and check it out that's it guys thanks for watching please subscribe for more